What's up guys? It's me, Beans, ForkinBeansTV123.com, or no, not .com, well almost, because we're about to have a side up anyway. So, uh, as you kind of remember this place from, uh, my friend's Nate Knight's 2 video, uh, we kind of come across a little situation here. You know, obviously there's snow everywhere, there are handprints and graffiti on the table, but What's really funny is now, yes, this is now, there is a bench, there's a table bench kind of thing in this tree. How did it fit in that tiny passageway or that one? This is really complicated to understand. Okay, so what we got out here is snow, 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 and more snow. And my tracks, of course, and then my bike, because I'm too cheap to drive my car down here. So, uh, we got that stuff, that stuff, that stuff. Oh, my God. You should see this during the daytime. Ooh, random person. I'm going to try to meet up with them, okay? See ya. Bye. Yes, because that was me today around... Noon, about, I think. And me pretending to know that I can drive a car. Well, that's the only reason that was the only clip that I could make of that video was because I lost my cell phone. This is Phone Stories. The story of how I lose my phone. A lot. Daily. Okay, so there I was. In the snow, scared, like super scared. I didn't know what to do. I went around, well, where I was at was a public school, so there, it was a really big area. So I went around it and lost my phone. Well, if you notice in the video, a few seconds in, you can hear a loud thunk. If you hear that thunk, that is my camera. Or not my camera, my phone. Duh. So there I was. Didn't know what to do. I was lost. What did I do? Like any normal person, I retraced my steps. What I didn't know is where it was was somewhere I wasn't looking. I was walking around in the snow with my bike, checking, leaving the tracks, looking for what my phone, where my phone was. I was with Nate Knight 2, oh, apparently, and what happened was, uh, I was just walking, and of course my phone falls out. So, we trace my steps down, da da da. After a while, it kind of got a little scary. I went around eight times, scared, like completely. At one point, I was actually singing about my phone. I need my phone so I can get back home cause I is lost in the snow. Yeah, that bad. Around the seventh time, I was getting a little worried. I was thinking, oh god mom, please don't kill me, please don't kill me, please don't kill me. And then I thought, son, you have failed me. But mom... Boom. So I thought, this is my last try. I have to go around one more time or my parents will permanently disown me. So what I did was I retraced my steps, kicking the snow, hoping to find my freaking phone. And then I hear... At that moment, I knew I was saved. I rushed over to the snow, picked it up, and then I dropped it again. Then I picked it up, and then I fell. I picked it up one more time, I put it in my pocket, and I rode home. But the ground was all icy, so I fell a few times on my bike, and 
Yeah. Now I walk with a limp. Thank you, Icy Road. I hate you so much.